Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Donald Trump could be blindsided by a so-called October surprise that would obliterate his chances at retaking the White House. Former Bush administration official John Yu has sounded the alarm that the former president could wind up in prison as soon as next month. Trump has been desperately seeking to hold of his sentencing hearing until after the election, following his conviction by a Manhattan jury of 34 counts of falsifying business records. But the controversial judge Juan Merchant has consistently denied his appeals. While speaking to Fox News host Bill Hemmer on Thursday, you said Merchant wields the power to order Donald Trump to jail immediately. Hemmer referred to Trump's sentencing as the story nobody's talking about. John Yu agreed, explaining that a possible jail sentence is the October surprise that'll hit in September. Five weeks from yesterday, Judge Merchant will sentence Donald Trump, the host continued. Merchant has been asked yet again to step aside. He refuses to do that. How do you see this playing? What does the judge do? Trump's legal team has unsuccessfully tried to get Merchant to recuse himself from the trial on three separate occasions. Each effort has hinged on the judge's daughter's work as a Democratic consultant, which the former president's lawyers argue compromises Merchant. By invoking the Supreme Court's recent ruling on presidential immunity, Trump is seeking to overturn his conviction. If his bid fails, the former president will be sentenced on September 18. You, a distinguished legal professor, commended Hemmer for paying attention to the case's schedule. Bill, it's excellent you noticed how the calendar is working this way, the former Bush official said. Merchant has ruled against Donald Trump every opportunity he's had, you continued. He could have exercised his discretion here to change the sentencing date. But instead, he actually moved it closer to the beginning of absentee voting in my home state of Pennsylvania. A key battleground state, Pennsylvania, is currently leaning toward Harris, according to the latest surveys. Could you imagine what would happen if Judge Merchant sentenced Donald Trump to jail time, even though he's a first-time nonviolent offender? You asked. What if Judge Merchant even went crazier and said, Donald Trump doesn't even get to stay out of jail while his case is on appeal? The legal scholar continued. Then you raised a shocking prospect. Merchant has the power to actually order Donald Trump sent to jail immediately, he said, before qualifying the statement, although I expect he wouldn't. But this judge has used the discretion every time to try to force this trial in a political direction that will have an effect on the election, the former Bush official concluded. On May 30th, the former president was found guilty of 34 counts of falsification of business records in an effort to conceal reimbursements to a lawyer who had wired hush money to porn star Stormy Daniels in order to keep her quiet about an alleged tryst. Trump's lawyers are now endeavoring to postpone the trial sentencing until after the presidential election. In a letter to Judge Merchant, Trump lawyer Todd Blanche argued that the current schedule courts the risk of election interference. Setting aside naked election interference objections, Blanche wrote, There is no valid countervailing reason for the court to keep the current sentencing date on the calendar. There is no basis for continuing to rush.